Hey everyone and welcome to this video. Today I'm going to show you what OpenRTP is and how to set it up. So first of all, what is OpenRTP? OpenRTP is an open source cross-platform RTP lightning control software. Um, it is cross-platform in that way it both supports Linux, Mac and Windows. But it is also cross-platform in that way it supports many lightning devices from many companies. Um, it supports both Hypex, Razer and Logitech and many more. I have a link for a site in the description that lists all the supported devices. Go and check that out. When we get to installing and setting up OpenRTP, there's a few options as you can see. There's both a stable and a experimental version of it. Now just download the experimental version as it has a lot more features. And now that we come to which uh, file to install. Um, now I'm on Linux or Debian and it's just really easy to install it. For me it's just to download the .dev file and open it with a program called Eddie and basically that. But on Windows it's a bit more complicated. On Windows you just download the file it's a zip file and then you're gonna extract it and inside the folder there is an openrtp.exe what you have to do with that is right click on the exe file and then click run as administrator and then you should be up and running now one thing that is a bit of a down of home rtp is that it doesn't have a super good interface and there's not a lot of features like effects and things but there's this uh, one plugin that is really good it makes it super easy to set really nice effects that works on all open rtp supported devices so now i'm gonna show you that Now to set up this plugin, we need to go to the GitLab site for OpenRTP and scroll all the way to the bottom. And there will be links to all the plugins. And today I will be showing you the effects engine plugin. So to install that, click the link for the effects engine. And then you will get to their GitLab site. And then you just hit the download button and download for your OS. And then there should be downloaded a zip file. Extract that zip file and after that you're gonna go into OpenRTP. Click the settings and then click plugins and then click install plugin. And then you're gonna go to the folder you just extracted, go inside that and choose the file inside the folder. And then you have your plugin installed. Now you can see when we are using the effects engine plugin, there's in the upper left corner a button you can click where you can see all the different effects and then just choose one and then you can see over to the right you can select all the devices you want to run on that effect and then you're gonna click start and then it runs the effect and you can see the visor effect here. So that was it everyone, thank you for watching this video all the way to the end and don't forget to like and subscribe. Also write down in the comments what the next video should be about and that video will be up in a month.